sugar went right to your phone. Yeah, oh, yeah, that was an explosion just now because I forgot to turn off my audio. Hello, hello, hello. Uh, there's a lot of noise in the background, actually. It's from uh, Star Renegades. It's got a dope-ass soundtrack, but unfortunately, I can't share it with you right now because uh, I want to talk to everybody about nothing, basically. This is an episode of Seinfeld where I talk about nothing. <laughs> I don't even know what that, whatever that makes sense. But hello, everybody. Welcome to the stream. It is time again to uh subject myself to um actually no today today um eh, since i did finish up black misa right okay so uh i see three guys in the chat poaching oracles and akate welcome to the stream i am a little bit doo-doo i am a little bit doo-doo because i uh just made it through my first uh first week at work and you know what i feel really happy that i'm actually doing something although nowadays i just find myself being quite tired and hey remote work from home is uh not very easy after a while <laughs> anyway um yeah um what else am i gonna say oh uh, yeah today um a few things happen one work <laughs> Yeah, work happened. Uh, sorry. No. Uh, one big thing that did happen today was uh, Halo Infinite's launch, and uh, this caught me off by surprise because I did not know it was launching today, or uh, more specifically yesterday. So um, yeah. I oh, know. More specifically, it did come out today. It's, it's just like the fifteen in uh, was it called the fifteen in uh, Americas right now. So yes, I like to say Halo Infinite has been launched, and I've been playing on and off. Um since this afternoon and i'm really really happy to report that um this is worth replacing battlefield one over i know poetry i know your brother's a battlefield death but come on but halo infinite got that little punchy like a poop like a poop like that like a nice and it's gonna be so fun for you guys to watch it as well it's free if you have like the space download it it's completely free and you don't even need to buy the battle pass to experience that solid old get halo gameplay so yes I am very looking forward to playing it. So, uh, what else happened? Um, more work on Arma, I guess. I have been so stuck on like making missions in Arma, and um, yeah, I I I think I'm I I actually just make a realization since I'm playing I got I'm having a collaboration with Agate this Saturday. Um, was that that was free? Yes, it's free. The campaign is the one you pay the good money for, but the multiplayer is completely free. It is so, so good. I love it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. If, if, you got, if you got the hard drive space or the solid state drive space to, uh, you know, have it installed, go ahead and uh, join me. Because I'm lonely. I don't talk to you guys enough. <laughs> so anyway, um, yeah. I've been working. I've been working on Arma Tree, uh, for the la last week or so, and I I don't know. I think I'm starting to get slightly uh tired of it, and but I I just find myself going back to it because I I just want to make small tweaks here and there. So um, I think I'm just gonna make that conscious decision to you know just like stop and uh take a take a breather, enjoy Halo Infinite for what it is. I got a collaboration this Saturday. That means I don't even have to engage in any Arma Tree operations as well. <laughs> Anyway, um, right. Collaboration. I'll discuss it with you later. Akate, you better be here because you're the ones giving up the details. We're playing SCP, right? 
Anyway, today we are playing um, a turn-based game. This is going to be quite unique for a stream because, um, well, not, not the idea of turn-based. I was playing Monster Hunter on stream, so uh, just doing occasional rests, doing one thing for a long time. For a long time is pretty draining sometimes. Yeah, it is draining. Like it's like writing a story and then you just it's getting stuck in the chapter. It's like I need I, I, I don't know how to proceed. And I think the armor thing is really starting to kick in. Even like making something the second part of armor though. Um Operation Peacekeeper, um it we'll get a continuation soon, maybe. I don't know. But the one I'm working on is just a, a full on scale uh military operation and I hope more people join for it actually. The other one, the third one that will come after it will be a very cute one with anime girls. Tr trust me, it's gonna be Hello Hunter Kami, welcome to the stream. I, I apparently seem to be staring at the <laughs> Hi everybody, hello, welcome everybody. So, um right. We got all the moves, we gotta set in, uh, my hands are jiggling, I don't know why, I actually gotta close the door, give me, give me a second. As long as I can play UMP9, I'm so sorry, I had to choose UMP45 over his, over his sister. You see UMP9 on the base, trust me. <laughs> Maybe this will be done first. I don't really think I have to do anything, but I'm definitely gonna be playing for you one. Anyway, um, today, um, we're playing, uh, we're playing another turn-based game because I just realized Monsanto Stories was the thing I stream, and today's turn-based game will be a game called Star Renegades. Let's get right into it. I have seen slight bit of reviews and videos about it. I was just catching up on like an IGN video about what it is. It seems to be a very interesting game, actually. Um, Turn-based, pixelized. Let's just let's just get into the game right now. Uh, you, the the soundtrack is gorgeous. Like, look at the game. It looks really good. Uh, so, um, you probably noticed the screen is slightly goofy. The layout is slightly goofy because I'm still trying to experiment with like the best way of like moving stuff so I'm, I'm trying to figure out what's like the best resolution i can play without like most of my head blocking it like if i switch back to my if i switch back to my mercenary outfit you can see that the skull takes up like a bottom right thing and that's not a good thing that i want to do so um yeah i'm gonna switch back to my civilian so that you guys can see any essential information especially because this is a turn-based game and i think some important information is going to so um let me just fill you in what star renegades is it is a i already said it uh let me try and find some information about the studios i should have done my research on this so let me see what what on earth did they what on earth did they they have retro space strategies as well mm -hmm. Yeah, okay, so it's just Star Renegades and nothing else. So is this... Oh, they have Halicon 6. So this game, this company seems to be quite small. It's an indie company, but it's got some sick vibes. So let's just not... Uh, let's just um, head right into the game and see what there is to do. It's targets, target frame rate. Let's see if we can bump this up to 120. Should be fine. Okay, I'm going to turn down the screen shake because I get... Really screwed up with this. Let me toss a question out there for everybody. How are you guys doing? You guys doing okay? Okay, let me just see. Um, I don't think I need to do anything. I, I I'm new to this game, so let me just find out what to play. Yes, I'm completely new to this game. This is something I did not plan to do play on stream but you know what i was just really really interested in like hi ah, doing well thank you or that's very good to hear from oracle look at that pixel art that is gorgeous <laughs> oh jeez i like the asian girl already the i think i think she's one of the protagonists from the screen looks pretty cute look at the art it is gorgeous you, you. Holy shit! Wow, it just, it just sucked out, man. Hello, Afik. Hello, welcome to the stream. Thank you for coming. I see you're a new guy here. Oh, are you new? I, I don't even remember. 
Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm glad you guys are doing good. Also, she's she has an, she has an R wing. God dang, that ship reminded me of like a Warhammer ship immediately, just with like the crazy beam spam. So, uh, I guess we're picking up where this chick crash landed or something, because this is gonna be quite fun. Oh, but Norosh, a small force of mysterious raiders destroyed the uh, destroys the mighty Star Union Armada. The surviving starfighters attempt to regroup, pursued by the relentless enemy squadrons. Oh, okay. W w oh! I just nearly killed a woman and... Uh, does this bother me? No. Collateral damage is on no issue. Oh. So that's the brother and sister. Okay, so I guess this is the main character. You get, you get points for missing all those buildings. Uh, at least he's giving us credits for that. Oh, Zup Zup <laughs> What? Oh boy, I landed by the train before Garen can make. You can get those attackers. Oh, okay, you can get those anti-aircraft guns online, so the game immediately hits you with that objective, so this is nice. That'd be a nice surprise for these fighters following me. And it kinda it kinda illustrates a good point about the protagonist. So uh So sure, the government tells us to uh tells us that some mysterious fleet just appears out of nowhere, they pass some laws confiscating Make massive stockpiles of mega nuclear materials. It's all. Huh? Okay, I see. What's cooking good looking? Hello, Afik. Welcome to the stream. We are playing. Um, we are playing Star Renegades. How are you? Hello, hello. Um, it looks like we've been shot down. So, uh, wait, hold on. There's a thing here. Not the best use of taxpayer credits. Well, uh. You know, taxpayer credits can be used to do a lot of things. You know what? Uh, nuclear weapons are, uh. Nuclear weapons are one of those things, and those are not very good. <laughs> how are you, Afik? How are you? Uh, uh, Afik, uh, how, how are you? Uh, how are you doing, Afik? Uh, you recovering from your um, little uh, space? I was watching a stream the other day. They aren't commuters. These raiders have brown suits. Huh? Oh, oh, okay. Yeah, I was making a joke that this is gonna be Fire Emblem based, but uh, this looks very interesting. Prepare to meet my doom. Yo, oh, oh. <laughs> What? Okay, he's just, just like, please kill me. I want to commit suicide already. <laughs> okay, let me just. Okay, so I'll just hit him with a cleave, I guess. Oh shit, just crit. Okay, so there is a progression meter on top, so this will be somewhat fascinating. So it looks like the ar enemy has armor. Crit him with a slash. A crit occurs when a unit is hit before they can execute their action. The crit bonus that is applied is shown below the attacking powers mean the attacking powers mean information. Crits can break the enemy's attack. Be careful though. Be careful though. The enemies can also crit your heroes if they are hit before they can execute their attack. The art is fire though. The music is great. Like <laughs> I just diverted to the music. But I think both of these things is really freaking good. It's all pixel. So we're supposed to hit something fast. Nice. Let's get that. Ooh, nice. I think this breaks the enemy, right? Oh, no. Doesn't break. I was matching with a hue to break him and stall his attack. Enemies, any attacks can stagger an enemy's action. Delaying it will execute later in the round, allowing the squad to execute more actions and crits before the enemy can act. Ooh, so this is very interesting already because this is not strictly like I was thinking of Fire Emblem. Every time I think of a turn based game, I always think of like Fire Emblem because yeah. The amount of stagger with an attack will do when it crits is shown in green. To 20 seconds. With careful planning, you can chain attacks together and man multiple staggers on the enemy, break them by pushing them into the next round. Oh, okay. Enemies cannot be staggered beyond the end of next round. Ooh. So you can cheese the enemy. Okay, so... You can crit and it knocks him into the next... It knocks him out of the turn. And he's about to get Nene and he's bleeding. Well, he's certainly meeting his doom pretty soon. Okay, so th there's a lot of complexity out straight out, but... I think the game looks really cool. And uh, trust me, I've never played this game before, so uh, yeah. I'm at a kind of base, that's why it's been hit by some kind of EMP. But at least the coast is. I, I, I just. I keep talking like a British. 
teleported in. Union techs have been researching that for decades. How these guys do it? They may be more advanced, but at least you can take them out in a fight. Oh, just remember your training. Ah, yes, remember my training. Uh, that's gonna be a problem, isn't it? Yes. One of these Titan's hands. Wow. Look, this Titans is like Doom Eternal. Oh shit. Okay, so it looks like okay. So it looks like we can engage him straight. Oh god, it's a pyro. It's a fire bat from uh, it's a fire bat. Uh, what is this called? It's a fire bat from StarCraft. <laughs> so yes, everybody. As you can say, this 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 attack this game looks pretty cool. And uh I like the aesthetics. It's really it, you can really feel like it's uh, inspired by other games, I guess. Whoa, that's a bit hot. Oh boy. Uh, me and Win, that uh, me and Win uh, is getting getting a bit innate, so but it's okay. Let's see what this does. I didn't fully read that because I have really bad. Oh, so it has light attack. Okay, I see. Oh, so fast attacks work. I think I, if I look correctly at the symbols, let's break them in So you have to defend as well. Please, Sounder. Okay, so you can also set to defend. Oh, jeez, that's hot. hot yeah. This looks pretty sick, yo. Yeah, this has been on my list for a long time. <laughs> I like how she has attack names for her attack too. Like if you take a look at it in the universe, she's like she's not being exactly soft about it. It's like Sunder! Sunder, there's enemy! Ah! She just didn't she just didn't aid her. <laughs> Wait, is it aid her? Or was it a salt plunge from Link in Super Smash? Critical Smash. Yes, let's go. Defeat the fire bat. And then he goes down. Oh. Nice, nice. Looks like I could use his guns right now. Uh, have I ever tell, told you guys that this guy kind of looks familiar? Or maybe I'm just thinking of dreadlocks in a bad way again. <laughs> Those enter air guns. Yeesh, little sister, the rescue though. Um, I know you want to show your face and all, but um, lady, where where's your chest plate? The <laughs> the chest plate is just gone. And the flux was not mostly used for training. Yeah, sure. Why not? Um, okay, so I guess I gotta go through here. Oh, okay. So the map looks really okay. No. Okay, so I gotta go to this terminal. Okay, now we gotta blast the stockings. Oh, okay. There we go. Oh no. Oh, he's summoning a destiny orb. Oh boy. Is this where the brother gets nanied? I don't. Oh, the brother doesn't get any. But at least he's here. You're alive! We've got to get out of here. Can you walk? I have standard military issue. Power armor. You think I can't walk from that impact? <laughs> Come on, let's go, let's go. Just a little shaken. That was a close call. Whoa! I found what you're looking for, mother. He's as pathetic as you said he'd be. So his name is Bastion. Is this an enemy? Uh, is this a nemesis? No, it's a guy in a suit. You're alive. It is nothing. <laughs> okay, this would be interesting. Kind of sounds like that. Not the time for jokes. Remember, find his weakness and exploit it. Maybe I'm sounding like that now. Use inspection mode to view unit stats and who they are targeting. Oh. Prediction of the outcome of your actions on that enemy that round. If your actions presumably the result in the death. Kill shot indicator. Let me execute their action before down. Okay, I see. No, no, it's hundred percent accurate. Oh, okay. So at least they tell you it won't necessarily happen. So where is this again? So he's attacking me. Blocked by shields and armor. Uh, irradiated. So what is he weak against? Uh, weak versus heavy attacks and resists light attacks. So we're gonna have to hit it hard with something. 
So let me just figure out. Okay, let me just figure out which which attack uh, does heavy. Okay, so this I guess the insect is heavy. Um, let me see. Hue is light, but however. Okay, there you go. I think this works. All right, he's gonna resist the hue, but I get to move him back, roughly. Okay, now I get him roughly back, and then Davian can just hit him with a previous sec, and there you go. But it does not stop him from firing that laser, which is uh, oh no, it did stop him from firing that laser. Okay, who is he? Who is he attacking now? He's still attacking me. So Davian, Davian will always go first. Okay, so I don't want him to crit. So I'm gonna defend myself from the laser storm. Whoa! Dude, for like an en for like a normal enemy, I assume this guy looks scary as shit. <laughs> He's got that menacing aura and remember that combo attack we used to practice? The one that we the one we broke that scrap hopper's window doing. Now it's a good time to try it out again. Just enough fury. I, I don't want, I, I know it's a I know it's a game advice thing to just tell you what to do but sometimes it's a bit like you uh you wonder what the characters are actually saying in universe like do they actually come up with names and if there is an explanation for it I think it gets kind of cute if it's not it, it's just there you know just there okay so let's hit him with the vivisec again and then uh, we can cancel him out with laser storm Luckily enough, um, Laser Storm seems to be pushed back and causes bleeding at the same time. You can just slap him with the crits over and over again. Oh, okay, he did fire the Laser Storm. Oh! That is dope. Okay, so I guess we can hit him with the Sifex Slam. Ooh, let's go. Woo! Double Eater. And that is a KO. He is going down. The monster has defeated the dino the robot dinosaur. A temporary setback. Mother shall soon have her victory. Huh? Oh! Oh, he's got a minigun now! He well, I'll take care of this guy. What he lacks in charisma, he makes up for in hideousness. Mother only wants you, Davian Sifex. Sifex. She has no interest in the female. That's kind of sexist, bro. Whoa! Okay. Okay, let's see what this guy is up to. Uh, this guy is the Herald. That, oh, oh no. Okay, I, I, I'm feeling like this is going to be a... Uh, I'm feeling like this is going to be one of those... Uh, what's it called? One of those boss fights where you have to lose, you know? Kind of mandatory. But this is going to take a huge chunk out of uh, our shield. So... Do an arm break. So let's see. Oh, it only pushes him back a little bit. Nope, does not push him back. Okay. All right, let me see if I can hit her. Okay, there you go. I can hit him both uh, for two crits. Let's go. Ooh, that's nice. So he can actually take shields. That's cool. Alright. So we gotta break that armor. And I, I really feel like this is gonna be a non-winnable boss fight. It's taking far too long. The results are inevitable. Oh. Okay, I see. It's a game over. I uh, see. I knew it. It was gonna be. It was gonna be a game over thing. I, okay, so I can't take back the turn. So, uh. Yeah, I think Dav uh, Davian is going to get captured or uh, Nate, but it's okay. Ooh, he can do the Zelda sword troll. I like this part on it. It looks really freaking cool. So, yeah, um, Davian is going to get Nate, and he's dead. Defeated is, the mo Defeated is my brother. This can't be happening. Mother, I have done what he asked. Bring me back. I cannot last much longer. Oh boy. So is my brother gone? Oh. The throne room is where you can feel the lead. 
View details on Imperium hierarchy and the currently known leaders, behemoths, and adversaries. Brought here to witness events such as deaths, promotions, and introductions. Oh, is it the Nemesis system from the... Okay, so uh, I'm not sure if everyone knows about this game. It was a lot of the Rings game. Uh, I think it was Shadows of Mordor. They had a Nemesis system. I think this is exactly the same Nemesis system. Adversaries are the elite soldiers on Imperial. They're stronger, tougher, and have unique stressful traits and abilities. They also have unique personalities, so no two adversaries are ever the same. Adversaries can also be promoted, evolve, grow stronger whenever they are able to defeat you. Yeah, these are definitely... This is definitely Shadow of War. So up here will be the Herald. So this guy, 50 plus defense against staggers. He has no weakness. Alright, so we don't know the rest about here. And uh, let's see if the brother is dead. I am... There, I found him. I, that's where the Imperium is made it next. They must have already started their attack. There's only one left to do. Turn you on. Oh, I'm... Oh, I'm, I'm a woman. I'm another woman now. It looks like a... looks like a... Tech priest from Warhammer. I'm getting a lot of Warhammer bite from this. Maybe this fight isn't over after all. I did a pretty good job making you look a run a mill civil job, civil bot. That should come in handy. Now, J Jet. J how, how do you read it? J5. J5T. Justin. Oh, okay. I hope you beat the way. Alright, so it's me, the robot. So I guess we're playing with two plots at once. Yeah, it looks like we're playing with two plots at once. So I think it's this lady and then there's the win, the Sifrex twins. And uh, oh, okay, everything's on fire again. These buildings usually on, on fire. Lady, I don't think there's ever a well where buildings are usually on fire because that is a, that's a big no-no. Viewers, if there's a building on fire next to you, don't assume it's your neighbor uh, overcooking his egg. That's a, that's a real problem. Call the fire department. The attack just ended, but they'll be back soon enough to finish the job. So we have to hurry. The entry point is right over there. Yeah, uh, who attacked this? Imperium? Pay attention, J5. You need to walk through this portal and deliver a very important message from me. I need hair. I need hair growth solutions. Prime Professor Zurek. The only other person I can trust. Sure, why not? Might be a little testy, but that's just how geniuses are sometimes. Find them and play the message I gave you. Can you do that? Hmm. Oh my goodness. He's got emojis! And a dog emoji. I'm I'm a fan of this character already. I'm a fan of this character because he has he has dog emojis on his head. Like look at that. You can't convince me this is not cute. <laughs> yeah, I like it. It's very cute. Alright, Justin. Uh I'll take that as a yes. Alright, Tech Priest, I'll leave you. I'll, I'll get your hair gel. Come, I'll, I'll get you your hair growth solution. Don't worry. No, try not to let you give a big hit or spear, I suppose. Go through the portal when you're ready. Is that? Don't worry about me. Your mission is the only thing that matters anymore. Uh, yes. Bye-bye. Bye, mom. He's good now. He is hoping he can. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Yep, this is definitely a... It's definitely a subplot. Oh. Many of you tell me what they have been meant to you. You tell them directly. Jen Geddon. Jen Geddon. Oh, so yeah, they've been dead already. Sad. A moment of silence for a fallen warrior, please. I like how the brother is introduced just to die. I think this will all blow over. I'm going to be relaxing in my deeply buried bunker. Yeah, you know what? I, I prefer the bunker. All this interventional invasion talk is all bogus conspiracy theory nonsense planted directly into our brains by the secret cabal of Corpus C. Wow, you're not exactly subtle, aren't you? Uh, this game is not exactly subtle on the uh, social commentary, isn't it? It's the end. Listen, messenger bot. I saw you materialize out of nowhere. If you're here to call it, conquer our galaxy from your nether realm, just let me know how I can hook you up. <laughs> Excuse me, you're willing to sell out while we're all here? Wow, these people are very eccentric. This girl, not really, uh, not really helping anyone of value here. What's this? Quantum flatulence phenomenon. 
so you're telling me the galaxy farted and then uh, the universe farted and gave us a bunch of killer robots because flatulence means fart. That's an English major kicking. Prove the non existence of space whales. Physicists will get some Oh, before. I'm very angry at this reference. Never. I, I, I am somewhat of a hardcore Star Wars fan. Never reference Life Day around me because this makes me feel angry. Angry. <laughs> Life Day is terrible. Okay, so uh, the joke here is that uh, Life Day is a. Uh, was it called? It was a. It was a thing that happened in the Star Wars Holiday Special, and uh, yeah, it's 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 not very cool. It's a. Uh, is it a cringe compilation? Yeah. So uh, yeah, I I don't know. Some of you have approached me wondering what the council plans to do with these raiders, the ones that destroyed their mother and killed Colonel Sifex. And as a member of the joint team, we have a plan. We will rebuild the armada, stronger than ever, and then we'll send a vessel to the hell it came from. The game seems, this game seems nostalgic. It's actually intentionally, I think it's intentionally pixelated. Pochek, you're so welcome back. Um, so it does have that uh, old fashioned feel to it, but it looks really cool either way. I'm Mr. Justin. I'm, I'm the I'm my I'm, I'm a BMO robot. What did I say about not being? Oh okay. Oh it, it's it's a clone. Am I a clone? Okay. Hello, Doctor Zero. Okay, that's that counts. I'm you and you're me. We're from different realities. I know this is highly confusing even to you. Oh, cute outfit today. Thank you, Mooching. <laughs> I like to go casual because this game is not too strict on though. So uh, there's a par parallel reality and I guess that's where the Imperial I'm from. Hyper advanced server bot across the quantum divide to warn you. Your reality is under attack. Oh okay, I see. <laughs> she 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 read her, she read herself. It's like a Doctor Who episode now. <laughs> Special. The Armada has been struck by a starship of a management power cloaked in the entanglement. This ship is from another reality, and its goal is to conquer your entire galaxy because they already conquered mine. I've got to warn them, but it's far too late. But when the council calls seeking a brilliant expertise, you'll need to have a plan ready. We follow my lead. But if you fail, I promise you send Justin True to the next reality they invade because they will never stop. Here's the plan. Reach out to General Geddon and play him this message. You'll need to explain to him, but he'll help you form the kind of task force necessary to bring this invasion down. Okay, oh, wait, what? What's that? What do I do? Huh? Um, I, I did something and uh okay, I I guess uh I guess I accidentally skipped the story. What's going on? Why did I skip the story? Time to subdue some locals. It's rough my shadow. Rough my nuts. <laughs> Enraged when hit with a counterattack. Immune to armor damage. Weaknesses weak to laser damage and weak to pulse damage. I I, I don't you like it when you uh, accidentally um skip story scenes because uh, you can't tell what's going on. Oh so there he's just sitting here. So I, I I think I'm assuming I'm with the lady. I'm the lady now. Sorry about that, the engineer said the landing would be smoother. I don't worry about it. I've gone through worse landings recently, uh, lately. So as you and Justin survive, it's your success in my book. I'm, I'm, I'm picturing him as like Bill from Left 4 Dead. Bull freaking horse! Oh, I say that. So how are you? You should help your little compa your companions with the pawns. It seems they're having a little trouble with the hatches. Let's see who we're gonna have as our companions. Let's see you. Saboteur's landing pod. Let's see who it is. Oh! Oh my goodness. He looks like Nathan Fillion. What are you doing? Just talking like a space marine. Don't like it. I can switch to no no normal style. Why don't you do that? Normal this boy. Yeah, that's just like all my friends. And uh, who else do we have? Archon's landing pod. Oh, we got the... We got the... Zulk <laughs> How was the trick? What to love and bring safely to the battlefield. You got a Titan from Destiny here. 
Hey viewers, guess what? Remember when uh, you know good timings because uh, this woman just exactly brought up this fact that I said Titans. You're gonna try and convert me again. <laughs> what the heck? One of the elite officers will be stationed in the base, and you have to go through him. We'll be on contact, to provide mission specs along the way. Ah, don't worry about it. See, I told you that's how Space Marines talk. Go past our favorite of our objective. Boss ladies, these fundamentalists aren't funda fundamentalists aren't that big on sarcasm. That is true. We preach a radical form of honest discourse, devoid of exaggeration or any form of subtlety. So basically, in other words, you have a your robots program with a mental illness. I get ya. I get ya. I I also have it too. <laughs> I'm really liking this crew of people. A sarcasm to idiot human. Am I? Oh no, they're not robots. Okay, so I guess, uh, I guess, oh, oh, we got a food car. So, uh, camping cart reward. We got a resistance to pyram burning for two combats. Exhausts when you use. The mystery, the magic, the mystique of hands. Yeah, I, 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 look, buddy, I know your right hand is probably bigger than the left hand. But either way, you can worship hands. Just don't go too far. In the end, it's just a hand, but a really, really old hand. You see, the right hand is always older. Inside the hand, they'll never squeeze, they'll never squeeze shut. Never. Why are you so mean to him? He's just a nice little robot man, and you're gonna, you're gonna make fun of him. Oh, I'm gonna get DNA. What was DNA for? Evolving. Okay, so, uh, oh, I can level up. When you've obtained DNA, you can use it to level up your heroes. Well, um, just to recap, this is a turn-based game. If you're not been here for a while, but yeah. Ooh, I can level up the Archon. He's level, he's one level up now. I should have probably saved that for someone, but the game was just... So we got a drone here. Let's go. Ooh. Okay, so we got two laser blasters. It looks like we may have to tahan a bit more. So let me see here. Laser blasters will take out shields and can knock us back. So... Now, why is one stronger than the other? <laughs> okay, so uh, let's see what we do here. So the laser blast will take us out. The shields will take uh, get taken out. So I guess we're going to push these guys back. And they have no visible weakness. So yeah, I guess we can just hit them with light attacks and get them pushed back. So uh, apparently Wind has lost a lot of her abilities. Oh boy. This is not cool. Okay, so discharge AOE. Oh, this will hit them back. Okay, so who? Blitz. Oh, oh shit. Okay, let's uh, let's see what we can do here. Um, is there is there something else we can do? Straight shot. Okay, this one, this one already be knocked back. Okay, you know what? Let's just reduce the chances of uh, anything happening. So we get rid of this one. We get uh, rid of this one first because uh, since it's reduced defense, let's see what it does. Ho! It's got that Peter Quill vibe. All right, so. Woo! That's cool. So, we didn't kill one, we did reduce the defense, and knock one out, so that's good enough. So let's move this one back, I think we can kill, uh... We can hit this one with and then after that, we can hit one of them with a laser, with a straight shot. So the, the, the AoE should kill them, by all means, but no, never mind, it didn't work. Oh boy, this ain't good. Okay, so we got one. But it means the laser blast can still hit us. And unfortunately, it doesn't really do that much shield damage. Okay, so let's just... Let's just uh, whack the heck out of everything. I like his grasping his head in the back. Power! Oh, he's been defeated. So I got myself four DNA. This creature, the creatures from this dimension are hideous. 
Uh, tell that to me. I, I pretty much find you kind of kind of de uh, dangerous as well, buddy. What is giant gun symbolizes? Uh, it's a huge fucking gun. That's what it is. Sometimes a big gun is just a gun. He's the wisest man in the universe of the robot. He is really just the wisest one of us all. Wait, wait, wait. Is there anywhere I can go? Oh. Open up that crate or take whatever's inside. It's a criminal code statute 18 subsection 7B. We're gonna loot it. Oh. Ooh. Ooh. Give me this. Let's stash this. Impressive technology, yet a curse nonetheless. Imperium tech is more advanced than ours in every way, so feel free to steal anything you can. I wouldn't mind the opportunity to analyze it. Can you say steal? Yeah, he's got the, the face movement in the game are kind of weird. Yeah, I guess it's just the limitation of the pixels, I guess. But he's got his own charm to it. Not fire, it, it's not static like Fire Emblem, but it does make them feel a little bit more animated. And yet the actual Imperial soldiers are monumentally stupid. What gives? Took a doll. Our brain functions. <laughs> oh my god, so you're telling me if you cross dimensions, you become stupid. No wonder why I'm stupid as hell. No, so anyone guess why they refer to this AI as mother. Mindless psychotic drone soldiers with mommy issues. Um, that's kind of kinky, but I wouldn't say anything else about that. So it looks like we're gonna have to beat the stuffings out of this. Showing a lot of fighting spirits. Good for them. Too bad I must now end their lives. Let's go, let's go. Overwatch. Oh, okay, so what is Overwatch? Let me just see what is Overwatch. Cannot be delayed. So it happens at the end. So this one hates counters. Uh, weak versus laser damage. Weak versus pulse damage. Covering fire on an ally. Okay, so... Is there, is there a way I can go? Free action. Oh, this is Fury. Okay, so at least I can do this first. Hit them both. And then this one is laser, right? No, this is not laser. Oh, it will return fire. I see. Okay, so this one... I want this so... Let me see. I'm thinking. I'm thinking. My brain is smart. Okay, so the cleave will attack them. It will hit them both, and it will It will attack her. I guess my good guess is to take out this one. It's to take out this one, and then after that, delay this one. Let's see what it does. There we go. It, he did take a uh, Peter, uh, Peter Quill did take some damage, but that's okay. Alright, so the counters is there. So he's the one who can do a lot of counters. Good enough. Oh, that's a nice crit. Armor broken. So that means... It's like how a warrior from a real dimension hits. Yeah, he's, he's from the base... He's from the Sigma male dimension. <laughs> Versus marked. Okay, let me see. Oh, her shields are okay. But she will definitely take a hit from that. Okay, so we definitely... Alright, so we definitely want him out of the way. So this happens before anything else. So that's good, actually. Let me see if we can get him out of the way. So, let me think here. Titan Strength. Ooh, ooh! I can embower him with power. So he's got himself a free turn. Or did I just waste that? Oh, I think I just wasted it. Ooh, that's not good, isn't it? And I can cleave her. Oh, no, no, no. Okay, cleave is bad. We want to get something out of our way first. Ooh, okay, let me just see here. Okay, let's try this out. Okay, let's go for the slash. 
I, I, okay, let's just let you guys know, I'm not very good at turn-based games. If I, if I, if I can't save scum, I will definitely save scum. Auto fire. Okay, so we can try and take him out as soon as possible. There's a leak here. So this one will both crit them. So I can't push these back anymore. Let me see here. Okay, so they're gonna hit her. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna give her shields, and then after that, we're going to uh, hit her with this one. Ooh, nice. Okay, she's gonna take the hit from the strong blast, and then we're gonna heal up the shields. We're gonna heal up the shields from uh, with the Titan's ability. I keep calling him the Titan for some reason. Woo! I like the designs of the enemies. They look really dope. Concussion. Oh! Ooh, boy. That ain't good. Reduce damage. Now, this fight should go my way. The Imperium sticks together. <laughs> He's like, I did it! I got him! Return fire. Kill shot. Oh, if I do it, then he'll get hit either way. Nah, let, let's give this a try. You shock. Right? And then after that, kill shot, return fire. Okay, yeah, this is definitely kill someone. Right, there we go. One robot soldier defeated. Hello, Dylos. Hello, Adiputra. Welcome to the stream. I'm doing okay. We're playing a turn-based game called Star Renegades. And uh, we just got a man. He's dead. Dynamic duo. Defeated adversary lieutenant together. Exhaust is when used. Ooh, that's cool. I'm alright. I'm alright. How are you? You're stronger, so local. <laughs> He's dead. He's been defeated. Alright, let's see what we have. Particle blade. Pyro blade? Ooh. Blocked by shields. Okay, yeah, let's just equip that. That looks pretty good. How are you, Adiputra? How are you doing? Let me just see here. Ooh, let me see what she gets. She uh she gets pre uh, he gets preach? Trick shots can only be executed once per combat. I'm gonna level up the Archon because um I'm gonna get him to be a supporter. And after this, I can just level up the Saboteur because Saboteur seems to be doing a lot of freaking damage. So yes, that's all good. Wait, wait, wait there's relationships? There are relationships? Progeny. What? You're telling me there's a Fire Emblem system in this game? <laughs> there's a Fire Emblem <laughs> So it really is Fire Emblem. <laughs> you slice and dice those bogeys. Now their base belongs to you and you are in a break. So I can get some rest or push on in in the morning. Thank you so much. <gasps> camping allows you here and gain affection for each other. Each hero has their own set of camping cars that can play on themselves or others. Regenerate lost health, repair armor. Ooh. Companions. Is it gain affection for each other? They strengthen their relationship, unlock conversations and bonuses like beneficial traits. Hmm, Hello, Gigatron. Welcome to the stream. Thank you for the compliments. Yes, yes, yes. It's a regular hat, but you know what? It doesn't block up much of the screen, does it? <laughs> so yes, we're playing uh, for you two. Uh, we're playing uh, Star Renegades. This is apparently not a Fire Emblem game. Comforting words. Ooh. Burning for two combat, exhausted one. When receiving carts and campings. Okay, let's just use comforting words on him. I get I could pawn this. Wow, I don't know what to say. Um is there anything to say? So this 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 game seems quite interesting, so uh, I'm gonna give it to him. Thank the Titans. You're so thoughtful. <laughs> this is so cute, what the heck? 
All right, so I guess we, we still have four points available. We don't have anything to do, though. Oh, 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 there's still more. What is this? Oh, put the fun and fundamentalism. Gracias, Kemosabe. Ooh, okay. This is very interesting. Charming robe. But this looks nice too. Whoa, this is the greatest day of my life. Pamp he can preach! <laughs> oh my goodness, that is so cute. This is so, this is so cute, but uh, man, I like this. This is really nice. Cool, this looks useful. I have been praying for a gift like this. And off we go to the next adventure. <laughs> I really like this. Just like yeah. Oh shit, we got we gotta fight ED uh, two hundred one uh, ED two hundred one here. Where are we now? Which dimension? Fascinating stuff. Can't wait to get out of there, mother. You know, they're just so nice people. So uh, this is one. So his attacks do uh, uh, extra damage, more armor, hates nitro damage, resists heavy and pyro, but he is weak to light and fat. Phobium damage apparently. Right, and who are you? The Menku Behemoth. Ooh, that's not cool, isn't it? That's a behemoth. What is this? Hates light attack. Two strider. He's immune to armor damage and his weakens. Oh. Oh. So this is uh, very interesting. He hates light attacks, but he's weak against light attacks. Oh. Oh, that's going to be a bit different. That attack is defended. Weak against AoE, weak against light. Oh, this guy should be easy to take out. All right, let's go. What else is here? Oh, there, there is a lot more. I see. This game is gonna be a uh, quite a long journey, but it's okay. It's all good. This is our team. I have a mission of the right now. The Imperial can only small, small put small temporary ga dimensional gates. But now they find a way around this construct by using Titan Core, and an ancient ore buried deep beneath the ground of the Titan planets. The atomic structure of these cores have a high degree of quantum stability. Oh. So, uh, if the pyramid manages to get a hold of this energy source, they'll be open up a, a dimensional gate that's stable and big enough to bring a full scale invasion force. Wait, not start them invade and overwhelm our galaxy. Uh, no, no ish, no shit, sure. May you negotiate my pay scale real quick? No. We'll send in a behemoth to remove the Titan Core in three days. So, we gotta defeat a behemoth. Justin here is able to hack the system, but I'm not so sure. J5 only enough for three barrel breaches before he needs to recharge for the night. So keep a close eye on your resource, uh, time and resources. Now J5's command roll out. So I'm J5. Hedonist. Let, let me let me let my English tongue speak out, viewers. Hedonist dimension hopping quantum raiders. Oh, oh boy. For the planet is. Choose your path wisely to the landing zone. Marked by an objective marker. If you run out of time, you'll be automatically transported to face the behemoth. If you reach the objective area early, you can use the terminal there to reopen locked down areas or use the tent to make an early camp. For each day. I might lock down and you'll claim you claim it before the day is over, then no longer will be accessible. What's this? Mengquan Cyber Yurt Village. Hollow pick me? Just don't talk to the Minquins. They want to tell you about weed growing techniques for hours on end. Ah, just like the farmers I meet. I'm just kidding. I don't even talk to farmers. Aren't it totally disruptive of outsiders, especially international invaders? Hmm, I wonder. Okay, let me see here. So, this area is about to be locked down. Hmm, enhances shields. This area is about to be locked down. Impaired events triggers damage, contains credits, enhances armor. But this one contains DNA. And credits and the equipment. Oh, okay. This is gonna be quite interesting, isn't it? 
right. So, yeah, let's reach it. Why not? Reach it. Yes, let's go. We're gonna we're gonna whack this firewall. Let's go. Free action does not end turn. Okay. So this will knock it back. Let me see. What was this? What is the weakness again? Okay, this thing has no weakness in particular. Okay, so um let's see. Titan strength. Let's just hit him with all we've got. I don't think he'll do anything. He's a bit too slow for this. There we go. Get out here. We just hit him with everything we've got. Should be a straight shot. Quite literally. <laughs> oh boy. Okay, we can't we can't hit him back, so uh, this is gonna be a bit of an issue. Let me see who is he targeting. Okay, this one will be defending. And uh, let's see. Let's just let's just hit him with all we've got. So uh Cancels the OT effects. Okay, there, this would be good because uh, if, he, if she gets burning, uh, then after that, uh, never mind. If she gets burning, that means uh, this guy can heal her uh, or just give her shield. So it's all good. See, she's back to normal. Okay, and then after that, we can just hit her, hit him with everything we've got. Nice. Oh, crit. Arm break. And, uh... Oh, boy. That's not cool. So the shield, shield is almost broken for this guy. So let's, just, let's just hit him with everything we've got. But I'm going to give this boy shield just because I can. Turn-based games like these are very fascinating because there is like a... There's like an art to managing your turns and whatnot and what you have to do, especially when you don't have things like, uh, when you don't have things like, uh, uh which hero shields with Valkyrie, and you know what, let's increase the Valkyrie shield, Menku, Menku drone. Okay, let's see. There's a thing here I want to get, which has got loot. Let's go through here. But that should be fine. Alright, let's see here. Okay. And then after that, we can cleave. There we go. We just do we just do this as quick as possible. Just whack him. Whack him. But that does mean that we won't be able to uh, stagger him for the next turn. But it does mean that we can try and get out of his... Get rid of his armor. Okay, she will get hit. And then after that, maybe it'll be good to have a blitz? Yeah, it'll be good to have a blitz. So you can just lower his defense. Let's see what this does. Burn! Burn! This ain't good. Wait, that sounds from Supreme Commander. I just recognize it as the Plasma Blasting. Okay, let's see. Can I use Blitz to knock him out? Oh, yeah, I definitely can Blitz him. The fact that you can spam this is actually pretty cool. You can just always hit up with a Blitz. And then after that, you can uh, do this. Cleave. Uh, oh, Vantage. Ooh, increased damage. Let's save the Fury. I want to see what uh let me see, I want to see what we can do. Okay. Oh, yes. Armor break. That means it's good, isn't it? All right, all right, all right. We're getting. Uh, I'm getting the hang of the game, which is good, maybe. So this will be a kill shot. So everything will be killed. Yes. Nice. I like the Valkyrie setup though. It looks really good. Caleb Prince is dead. All right. Let's see. Now we can level up. Uh, now we can level up our little uh, little friend here with the laser rifle. Power trick shot. Okay. Someone here can uh, can they equip this yet? Insufficient level. Okay. Let me see. 
uncommon. So she can't, they can't use this. Okay, I see. Profit bot. Oh, so they are. It's a robot as well. Hmm. Okay, so the Reaver chick can only be used by her. And she needs to uh she needs to get up to level three to use this. Okay, I see. Wait, hold on, hold on. Let's see where we can go. So if we go through here, so we get the we got the Imperium. Hmm, let me see. We get to the landing zone. Oh, epic! Okay, so we don't have to worry about the food. Wyvern marked drone. Triggers damage. Contains credits. I mean, we're gonna just sneak past here then. This is actually just like the most easiest. It's actually like the easiest route. What strange things. Oh. Oh, there's DNA. Oh, there's DNA. Oh, yeah, there's DNA vats here. Yeah, there's DNA around here. I don't know why you can find stray DNA around here, but uh, viewers, trust me, that's not a good sign to find. Uh, who leaves random DNA lying around? Like, I, I wouldn't. That's just that's, that's my blood, man. DNA out there, that's kind of crazy. Crazy? Man. Okay, so we can leave the healing kit here. So the next step is that I want to go up here and challenge this dude, Anthropologist, the Menku Commander. I don't know where the land. Oh, the landing zone is here. But I do want to take the rope to uh, go down. So if I can go down here, I can just challenge him. So we can do that. We can just camp here for the night. Let's see what we can do. Preaching. Armor comp. Preach. 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 I bet I could, bond, I could pawn the preaching. I've been praying for a gift like this. Alright. Charming rogues. Uh, attack green shields. Okay. Let's try this. I'll add you to our mailing list. My dude. Okay. Th there's nothing much here. If you leave now, they'll be gone for good. Wait, do I need to actually have this? Hmm, this is interesting. Cool, this is useful. Alright, so that's good enough. Let's try and see if we can rush, because I, I'm not sure if this is... Club Wombs. Ooh, this is gonna be interesting. You know what? Screw it. Let's just see what this does. Hmm, this is gonna be interesting. Oh, shit. Smoke stream. Oh boy. Slowed. Okay, let's see. Okay, at least gonna hit them with this. Inspired. Ooh, okay. Alright, let me let me see what we can do here. Mm, okay. Oh, I can cleave and break her. But she's going to attack me. Which means if I don't. Hmm, this is gonna be somewhat of a trouble. Hmm, this is gonna be interesting. Okay, let's see if I can tank it first of all. I'm gonna try and tank it. Okay, let's defend ourselves first of all. Knock, knock them out of the park first. Okay, let's see what this does. Okay, all's good. Alright, so let, let's have her defend. Oh, okay, that guy's shield is down already. And he's burning. Ooh boy, this ain't gonna be good. And he's on fire. My hypothesis is that this is going well. Shut up, nerd! I'm here to kill nerds. Okay, 
So bestow shields, cancel the OP. Yeah, I should probably heal this guy up first. Burning Immolate pierces. Let, let's get him out of here first. This guy gets to go. Oh boy, he's gonna get angry real soon. Nope, okay, I can't kill him yet. Oh no, it's not even going to be a late kill as well. Oh boy, I'm gonna have to. Oh, what am I supposed to do? My brain don't work. Okay, let's try this. Hmm. All right, this, this should be good. This is the challenge I set myself up for. This is good. Oh, shit. Ooh, this is painful. You see, this is why I, I, I find uh, what's called these kind of games very interesting. Titan Strength. Okay, so we bestow shield to you. Big kill, but it does mean that this is gonna be kill shot. So you can get these out of the way first. That's good enough as it is. We gotta get him out of the way first because otherwise, if, if uh, the Valkyrie gets immolated, then it's gonna be a no no. That's a no no. Okay, out of the frame. Okay, that's good. Okay, minus armor. And you're gonna get healed up. Okay, so strong blast. Immolate still there. Okay, let me see. I'm gonna find a way to get rid of that armor. So it doesn't really do much, too. Okay, yeah, this will definitely this will definitely discourage both of their turns. But I do need to take out this guy's shields. So we're gonna use straight shot first of all. Knock these guys into tomorrow, and let's see what we can do here. 17 damage. We need to knock out that armor. Okay, there we go. Oh boy. Yikes! This is gonna hurt like a bitch. Yeah, we can't knock him back into next Tuesday anymore, so uh, we're gonna have to tank it. This is not gonna be a fun thing to do. But yeah. Was this a good idea? I'm not really sure. <laughs> Okay, then if we're gonna do this, we might as well just defend. But she will take a huge amount of damage. Okay, so here's the thing. Alright, let's try this. I really hope... Okay, that emulate only hurts me, so that's good enough. And it can just get the shields. Okay, there you go. That's... You're running a little hot night. Night sucks. Ah! I can't see! My hypothesis is now. This will go well. Shut up, all your fucking hypothesis. Okay, so uh, if I do this correctly. Um, okay, yeah, this, this is turning out to be somewhat interesting. Okay. See, I I'm putting on my thinking hat already. It's like, what am I supposed to do here? Okay, I can definitely kill shot her. So if I take out the goons, if I have, I have to take out the goons already. All right, there you go. The goon is down. That's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. 
Okay, so again, um, got the Blitz this guy. Crit stuns. Oh, oh, okay. Oh, okay, I see. So now he's stunned. Okay, so I can cancel turns. Okay, let's just hit him with everything we can because otherwise we're gonna get Nene very soon. So here we go. So what I'm liking about so far is that there there is this kind of X call. There is a slightly bit of unique uh, turn-based actions, and you know what? Getting this, I bend you to my will. Oh shit. Yeah, someone's gonna get really messed up here. Unfortunately, someone is definitely going to have to be taken in by this fellow. Okay, you're gonna have to defend yourself. I think Zerk Snurza can take care of himself. So that's good enough. We need the armor down, otherwise we cannot damage him. Ooh, that's not good. Ooh. Okay, so shields go here. We can knock him with the next Tuesday. Okay, so what what's this? It'll, it'll go down to zero. Oh boy. Uh, we gotta get down that armor to like five. I'm, I'm just thinking like, whenever I play these kind of games, I have to actually think. That's why XCOM, I'm just like really freaking quiet. Yeah, it just happens, you know? Win will lose lots of armor already. But there will have to be a time where I have to hit him. It's a crit bonus. Yeah, this is definitely gonna crit. I'm gonna have to tahan this for a bit. Okay, let's see. Crit armor break. Oh, perfect! Now with armor broken. Can't let her go down. That's the most important part. Oh, wait, what? Really? That's kind of poopy. He's going to run away. Really? You fool. You're going to run away. No, I still got to kill you. Come back here. He's running away. What a pussy. I didn't even get to kill him. Really? At least we got this tech. Let's see what we get. Ooh! Steals 2 to 4 armor. Oh! Steals 3 to 13 shields. Shield stabilizer. I don't really know. What should I have? I'm going to take this. Yeah, you know what? Let's just stash this. Let's go down to the healing kit and get the just healed up. I think we'll, I'll call it, I call it a day for like, uh, uh, once we beat the behemoth. Okay, let me see what else is there. Okay. Okay. So there you go. Bust through here. Okay, let's see what we have. Particle gauntlet, laser gauntlet, pyro gauntlet. 
penetrates armor. Let's just set this first of all. Gravelian mega temples. I've heard about those hollow creatures. Abandoned out, filled with giant mushrooms. Yeah, let's not go there. There's uh, lots of giant mushrooms there. He's very dangerous, very devilish. He smells like poopy. Should I go down here? <gasps> no, I missed my chance to have this guy. Shit. Oh, maybe we can go up here instead. Mm, let me see. I want to see if I can get down the lieutenants. Okay, let's level her. Let's level her up. Okay, now she's level three. She's got Syphaxian wit. Uh, what else? Yeah, let's just go down here. All right, let's go. Let's go down there. Yeah, there we go. Drake Vance. He's named after a fire. So we, we always have the weak versus AoE, resistant versus pyro. Let's see. Okay, this should do. Yes, there we go. Shields is down, so at least the lieutenant is easier to fight. Alright, there we go. Knocking to next Tuesday, which is good. But it does mean she takes a shield damage. Again, you're going to do something here. And I'm going to hit her. No, this will not. Okay, let me see. Is there anything else I can do? Weak versus light, weak versus AoE. Oh shit! He's weak to a lot of things. Okay, let's do the kill shot. Okay, she's gonna have to take the damage, but that's okay. Oh, no, that's all of us. Man, man, Peter Quill seems to be on burning. They can't respond. I like how these guys are just really normal dudes, but they're just like, I like this. I enjoy, I enjoy watching people get murdered. <laughs> it's just... Fun, somewhat innately funny for some reason. Okay. Okay, there we go. Then we can just knock him back the next Tuesday. Alright, there we go. Get out. Break, nerd. Look at that slam. Ooh, that's not good. Haunt's enemy. Yes. Come here. You will slap me in the face and I will slap you. Unfortunately, she is getting quite a fair bit of... Oh boy. Okay, this will, this will do quite a fair bit of damage. Oh, okay, I didn't mean to do that, but that's okay. Ooh, that's painful. At least, right, at least we got the shield. So, at least the shield will be able to get rid of any DOT effects. So that's good enough, isn't it? Yeah! Reduced to 50% health. Mother, save me! No, you're not running! We're gonna whack the stuffings out of you. Whack him, whack him. Whack him, whack him before he dies. I wanna kill him. No! He retreats. Dang it, they all retreat. <laughs> That's why I'm vi so violent all the time. <laughs> really? It's kinda that's kinda scary to think about it, but dang. All right, there we go. So, uh, all right, so you just see. I okay, he can't equip it. 
Okay, the credits here. Where else is there? Where is there been? Okay, this area is locked. Okay, we already have access to here. Okay, so... Okay, so we can't go there anymore. That's a bummer. Dragon lead. Okay, so let me see. Can I upgrade this guy? Nice! And it's level 3. Card gain patter. Okay, so this one, I guess level 3 can... Uh... Oh, he can't use it? Really? Oh, it's only for him. Okay, I see. Okay, so I guess that's it. He doesn't get anything. He's just sad. Mm, okay, I guess we can go here. Unlock all lockdown areas. Okay, so I can come back here, right? Later on? Sweet. Okay, so I guess I can just go here. I already have access to the objective, so that's good enough, right? Okay, so... Comforting words. I bet I could pawn this. I'm truly thrilled. Attacks called bleeding. Crit damage plus 25. Okay, let's give it to him. I always want it to him because uh, he's he's the one that does a lot of damage dealing. Once on this newer brew, I believe these enemies are smell alone is a challenge. I grew up near a pocket near the pocket dimension dump on Columnix. That was a smell that could raise a few hairs, literally, because when the dimensional funnel was activated, all the trash would float around the whole neighborhood. <laughs> How about you? A mansion on Fabuloso. Oh. But a crumbling mansion. Hmm, let me see. <laughs> ah, yes. 30 plus max shields. Yes. I will now add you to our mailing list. The mailing list one is just fun because it's just so cute. You know, Sox, I never really noticed your eyes. They're really beautiful. Piercing, even. Highly advanced data analytics system. You know what? I like a man who's honest. I like a robot who's honest. If someone is like honest for me, uh, like in this kind of situation, I think I will love it. This kind of honesty is what I vibe with because this is literally all I do and this is how I lose friends. <laughs> I'm just kidding. The robot's really nice. Did I have the creepy red glow all the time? I added that feature myself. It's just a little creepy. Hmm. I wonder why it's creepy. It glows red. If you see red glow, that kind of that kind of scares you, don't don't it? Okay, so we are about to breach into this area and make the stuffings out of this dude. Because I also need to get the armor station so that I can get a. Okay, here we go. Oh boy, what is this? What is this enemy? What is he? What is he all about? Flying grounded when stunned. Ooh. So flying when stunned. Oh, okay. So I guess I can do this. Now he's stunned and grounded. There we go. Oh. I can't even use cleave most of the time because it's like no action cue. Okay, so that knocks him out of the fray. You still crit them. That's not cool. At least he's grounded, which is good. Alright, there we go. 
<laughs> Hello, I'm Arnav Nagini. How welcome to the stream. I see you're new here. I'm Ethan Dylas. I'm playing a turn based game. I'm still your friend, your country. Don't worry, I was talking to you. I just meant. Uh... <laughs> I don't know what I meant. I don't know what I meant, buddy boy. Kill shot. Who's this again? Oh, yeah, that's right. Oh no, I can't do that. Okay, someone will have to take a crit, so that's gonna be enough, right? How do you are uh, Nagami? How do you find me? I'm playing Star Renegades, which is a very cool looking game. Ow! Whack. And he's defeated. At the ready. Alright, there we go. Ow! Ooh, that's nasty. That's just straight out nasty. Cluster bomb. Late kill. Oh, shit. Okay, so I can hit him first. Okay, then I can hit him. So how are you? How are you? Uh, sorry, my, my model just kind of freaks out. I'm a VTuber, so uh, I'm using a camera to capture my movements. And sometimes it just kind of freezes up. Also, my throat is really, really dry. Have I told you guys that I am... Uh, I'm not feeling too good recently, but that's okay. It's just probably something, uh, probably just something with my throat. But by the time I was working, I didn't want to panic my employees too much, so I have been feeling kind of under the weather, so yeah. Unfortunately, I don't think it's too good for me, but you know what? It's just okay. And everyone's dead, there we go. The behemoth is just gonna be the problem. Okay, let's uh, breach this section. These resistors think they're so great for fighting us. Don't they realize that all these struggles are meaningless when condemned to the heat death of the universe? <laughs> it's like... It seems like you have not been getting enough rest. Can I beat you to sleep? No! I'm gonna beat the crap out of you then. <laughs> You're nasty. You're nasty. You can't do that. What does Basculus do again? He's uh, weak to light attacks and then gets enraged to light attacks. He also has less health, so... This is his armor damage. Hmm, am I gonna take out the Wyvern? Oh no, that's a bad idea. Let me see, what, what this one is light, right? Oh, this is AoE. This will be a kill shot. Okay, that's good. I don't know, mate. Have I not been getting enough rest? I did try a nap today, so yeah. I guess I can understand. I don't worry about it. It's all good. And he's down. Defeated is the monster. Ah! That was fun. Can't wait to do it again. I need to put murdering aside for a second. Oh! Okay, that's not cool. Okay, so I think I'm gonna hit him with a blitz first. Let's see if I can enrage him and break him off his stacks. Oh boy, what does this do? I really hope this doesn't insta kill me. Oh boy. Ooh, would you believe I'm even crazy now? This is not definitely. All powers execute 5% faster. Knock him, knock him to next Tuesday, uh, Peter Quill. I'm just gonna call him. He doesn't even get to use the death beam. That's just sad. Does he get to use the death beam? I am not so sure. If he does get to use the death beat, I'm gonna be bold. All right, there you go. Okay, just, just, just whack this, just whack his stuff in. He's gone. We got him. Yeah. Defeated. We beat the adversary. Let's end together. Nice. No regrets! Yeah, at least he lived life to the fullest. 
He lived life to the fullest. Laser blaster. Oh, 15% defense. Oh, oh, this is cool. Okay, this is definitely for him. Mushrooms. Are these the famous sentient mushrooms of Menku? Keeps the growth under control, but in appearance doesn't bloom or ignoring them. Okay, I think. Why though? Oh, can I get there? Do I have to breach? Oh boy, I don't think I can get away with this. Oh, this is gonna be. This is gonna be kind of. So... Nope, this is not good. Oh, okay, I gotta breach the walls here. Never mind. Let's just okay. You know what? There's not much option we have to do now because if we breach this wall, it means we can have an extra breach charging here. Oh no, another roguelike. Not another roguelike. This is not a roguelike. This is a turn-based game. So yeah, one of those fascinating games, I guess. May interact with this to forfeit your charges and camp early. Okay, sure, why not? Uh, also, welcome, NG. I'm playing. Uh, I bought this game a few months ago, so yeah. All right, so we're gonna camp early. This affects some heat. Yes, let's have. Let's be some friends. Let's be friends together. You're so thoughtful. We saw terrible things today. I'll never get these stains out of my mech armor. Worry not, I will show you the secret stain removal secret of the Titanium Brotherhood. The formula is a tidy health secret. I'm honored. <laughs> That's actually really cute. <laughs> Comforting words to myself. <laughs> Wait, what? I don't, I don't even know, man. It's just very strange. How are you, NG? How are you doing? I will now add you to our mailing list. Heal Hell Shield Defense. Okay, so... You're the best! Now I don't have to steal it. Okay, yeah. We're definitely gonna have to fight. Whoa, this is the greatest fight. Oh, cool. This looks useful. Alright, so it looks like we're gonna have to fight the Behemoth pretty soon. Oh, we don't fight the Behemoth. The Behemoth has arrived. Yeah, let's go fuck him up. Big ugly thing. Ooh. There we go. That lengthy technical explanation of the science before. You know what? You can do that. You can do that real quick. I wouldn't even bother you. Let's go, let's go. It's time to fight this dude. Whoa! It's an ED201. So what is this weak? Okay, so what is this weak to actually? 35 armor. Jesus. Yeah, he, he's just gonna straight up. Yo, hello Francis. Uh, in Steam page, it says roguelike. Hello Francis, Christian, Roy, Kanonego. Welcome to the stream. We're playing Star Renegades. This is a very fun uh, turn-based game. And now a roguelike. Uh, is it a roguelike? I don't know. I wouldn't per se consider it a roguelike. I don't know. But there's no weakness to this damn thing. Ooh, that's not gonna be cool. Okay. Uh, okay. Increase damage. Yeah, this is increase damage. Yeah. Welcome to the stream, anyway. So, uh, how how are you? How are you doing? <coughs> Sorry, I I'm think something. My nose is starting to get really stuffy. And this is your new. I like to thank. I like to. Uh, introduce you guys to my uh, very slurred way of, you know, speaking. I am very slurred. Oh boy. Okay, let me see. All right, there we go. Let's just let's just get it out of the way. She's gonna get wasted, and I need to heal her shield up. We have responded to the restricted area, and we now submit to potential ju extra judicial. <laughs> yeah, this is what happens when you don't drink enough water. We have approached the restricted area and will now be submitted to potential extra judicial punishments such as, but not limited to, excruciating pain, dismemberment, and death. Ah, that's okay. I'm just that. Death, it's a normal part of my life. Bullet. Fucking hell. 
Oh, what on earth is this? Oh, that's not good, isn't it? Well, you see, when, you think, when the thing has bullet hell, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm thinking of a Danmaku, which is not good. Danmaku's like, like, the epitome of really bad shit happening. Okay, there we go. We got shield broken, I guess. Alright, so, uh, defend. Yeah, everyone should defend against this. Oh, jeez, Luis. You will soon die in my hands. Do not bother dispersing, as my mind will not be changed. I mean, they're just, they're just a bunch of stool kids. Oh boy. Oh, this is gonna be bad, Juju, man. God dang. This thing is gonna be hard to kill. How do you break this thing? Like the bosses itself is actually pretty dangerous. Dang. It's got that, it's, uh, NG, I don't know, I didn't know if you saw this, but it does have that channel of motor system, so yeah, it's gonna be cool. It's gotta be kidding me. Okay, so Titan Strength. Hold on, wait, hold on. I think I can just do the battle cry, right? Okay, so we can taunt the enemy. And then after that, I can just hit it with everything I got. Watch as all my attack So how's your day, uh, the new fellow? Uh, was it already? Uh, Arnav and uh, Francis, how's your day? Kind of curious to how you found me, but yeah. Shut up! Machine is talking. Oh! What is that? Wait, 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 wait. Hold on, hold on, hold on. What was it? Oh boy. Oh boy, I don't know what this will do, but I'm gonna get me I don't know, the behemoths are like really hard. This is like a tricky thing. Oh, fuck! Oh, please don't tell me he gets his shields back. I'm gonna be so angry if he does. So it gets back its partial amount of shields. Okay, so I guess what I can do is just, you know, heal up my dudes and then just get ready to, uh... Okay, so yeah. I'm gonna have to defend all this. There is no afterlife. Death is final in existence, meaningless. Wow, oh, who put Bright Rage Niech in the machine? That's kinda scary. Not gonna lie. Gamma. Oh, that's a kill shot right there. Oh, yes. Knock him out of the park. Knock him out of the park, and then we can do this. And then there's still shields to do. Okay, let's see. I feel like I'm wasting the staggers, but yeah, this just... This, this... I need to break the shields. I feel like maybe I am wasting the staggers. I don't know. Can I stun him? Oh, he can be stunned! Oh, okay, I think that's cool. Bleeding tree per round. Okay, so if he's stunned... Then I can just hit him for everything I have. There we go. Oh boy. Okay, there we go. More gamma beams. Oh shit.
Okay, okay, okay. Let me, let me think, let me think, let me think. Okay. Okay, there you go. That's good enough. All right, let's see. I can't. I hope. I hope the Titan survives because this is gonna be a nasty kill. Whoa! Holy shit! That was cool. No, go away. I'm gonna whack the poop out of you, and then you're gonna be happy. You're gonna be happy that uh, I did that to you. And now uh, who? Oh, okay. Now it's targeting me. Yeah, I'm gonna have to prevent the. I'm gonna have to prevent the Archon from getting murdered because this ain't gonna be good. So this is this, this is a this, this is like my first behemoth battle. I don't know whether I'm doing good with my version, but I feel like I'm doing okay. I've not played this game before. Trust me, I have never played this game before. So uh, I'm just doing my best to figure out what's going on. And uh, yeah. Another cleave should do it. Okay, well, it's a kill shot ready. And I'm gonna have to tahan this attack. Oh! Right, there we go. The crit. The, ble the bleeding is just like. Uh, Darkon's just like tanking all of it. Jeez. Get out of here. Nice. All right, there we go. Now we can finish it all. Yeah. There we go. So, this is not very... I, I guess maybe if you have played this game before, this game is not too difficult, but yeah. It's uh, very interesting. Get out of here. Smash. Smash the system. Yes. Woo. He's gone. We've gotten. He's dead. Mother, I have filled you. Bye, nerd. Wow. Managed to keep a kite on him. Look great while doing Another Imperium extraction operation. This time on Mirosh. Another behemoth. Rest up and spend some. Like you, they're the best one. I'll give you a point. Who makes up your team? We're waiting at base. Ooh, okay. So I get the. Could you really use a break? Ooh, very interesting. So, ooh, ooh. all right. So I get to buy one. So what do I buy? Penetrate armor. In field. Hold on. Gadget merchant. Wait, wait, wait. What? What is this? Okay, this is very interesting. So at least the behemoth is gone. What is this? What's a guardian? I could always do this. I could always. Yeah, sure. Give me the marksman. Woo! Park Chanlo. Okay, so let me just see right here. Wing. He gets a wing. What is a wing? New power wing. Swamp stories. So I basically recruited. So I basically recruited the 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 guy from uh, Team Fortress Two. I recruited the. I've recruited the fucking engineer. Not engineer. Is it engineer? You don't have resources. Oh, what? No, that's bad. So I recruited the the sniper. Shh. Okay, let me just see here. What 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 other thing was that ready? There was another weapon I could give him. Yeah, uh, yeah, he couldn't get the laser rifle. Let's just level up our saboteur. Croc. Yeah, he's a robot crocodile. 
He's got Swamp Stories. I want that Swamp Story. He just looks so cool, man. This is me. My new Robo Avatar. Density Gruff. Is this pulse damage? I can't buy this, but I can buy this. So let me just see here. I'm like, I'm genuinely very much enjoying this game. Actually, not 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 joking. I'm actually genuinely enjoying this game. <laughs> Wait, where, where did my thing go? Didn't I buy it? Where where did it go? No, I didn't want you to get. I didn't want you to have it. I wanted her to have it. Hold on, can I give him the reaver chip? Okay, there you go. There we go. Now she's now he's maxed out. But I really need to give her a better sword. So, uh, before we do this, is there a way I can save this game? Oh, okay. So, there's only save and exit. So, I guess I'll just stop it from here now. <laughs> Alright. So, it is uh, 9.47. So, uh, thank you everybody for joining my game. So, yes. Um, I'll just turn off the music right now. I actually can't hear myself. <laughs> anyway, thank you everybody for coming to Star Renegades. I actually really, really like this game. But, unfortunately, I don't think it'll be like uh, maintainable in the future. It's cool. But um, I'm not sure. Maybe I'll play this on my own. Um, in any case, there are a few things I can uh, invest into. So yes. What is it already? I don't know. Uh, Was it called? Um, yeah, that's it. That's it. Thank you so much for coming to my Star Renegade stream. So I see I got some new people. So uh, welcome, welcome. I'm Ethan Dylos. I'm a mercenary from the future. This is my civilian outfit. So uh, I work in another PMC now to make ends meet. But I am... I am... I do have my original outfit, but don't worry. Now, I still haven't finished my reference sheet or video for the freaking um, Twitter yet, but don't worry. I'll try and get on it. He is the croc. Yes, I am the croc. I wear the skull on my head, so yes, that's how cool I am. And, well, I like to keep, even though I have a very interesting way of letting myself know, I am not very loud or... Uh, there's attention chasing, so I just think, tend to stick on the lowbrow. So anyone who comes over my stream, I deeply thank you for coming because, yeah, it's pretty cool. Pretty cool to see that I'm reaching out. And with that, um, that pretty much ends today's... Uh, What's it called? Uh, What's it called? Um, Thank you so much for coming to my stream then. um, Yeah, and I really enjoyed playing this game. And if you have the spare money... If you're not playing Halo Infinite, that's it. Uh, you can buy this game, and it's a very interesting role. Like, and uh, you know what? Just, just have, just. It's a very good game. It, it, trust me. If you're interested in turn base and um, have a fair bit of in a uh, fair bit of uh, tactical aptitude, definitely not like me. <laughs> you can spot him shooting grunts in his onesies in his cage. Nah, maybe yeah. I pretty much shoot people in the. I, I shoot people in the head, but like that. <laughs> yes, my moderator is shooting for me. It's so cute. Yeah, with that, um, yeah, um, updates on this this week. Uh, definitely a writing stream to make up for last week, which I did not have a writing stream. So yes, and um, tomorrow a Halo Infinite stream. Stay tuned because I'm super excited to stream this game. <laughs> we'll do half. Uh, we'll do half Slayers. Uh, we'll do half uh four v four and then other half uh big team battles. Let's see how it goes. And if you guys are interested in joining and already have the game, you can just come and chill. I might invite another friend to play with me, uh, Karimaki, if she, if she downloads it. And then uh, anyone else who's interested. Yeah, basically like that. And with that, yeah, there's nothing else I can say. Thank you so much for coming to my stream. Uh, it's now 9.50 and with that, I got to I gotta get sleep early and uh, you know what? <clears throat> got to sleep early and make sure I can rest up because tomorrow I got a meeting as well in the afternoon. And with that, thank you everybody for coming to my stream. Glory be a day. I feel much better. <laughs> just streaming here or playing the silly game with that thank you so much and i hope you guys have a good night thank you oracle thank you kate thank you francis uh thank you ng thank you fig hunter pochek uh adibucha giga sean and arnav thank you for coming to the stream and i'll hope to see you guys next time see ya